It's a chemical that is used by farmers across the world. Ammonium nitrate, used to make fertilizers, is also a key component of a common industrial explosive, a NFO. But in the past century, the chemical has also caused blasts that have killed hundreds of people. And that's what Lebanese authorities say happened in Beirut. Although the chemical generally doesn't explode without a catalyst, under certain conditions it does. If it heats up, parts of it turn into gas, pressure increases, and then it explodes. In Beirut, it seems extremely large quantities were seized on a ship and stored in warehouses since 2014. <laughs> Before the blast in Beirut, ammonium nitrate has caused explosions. In French firm AZF in 2001, killing 31 people in Toulouse, and a Texas fertilizer firm in 2013, where 15 people were killed. The areas hit are often ports, like in China's Tianjin where 173 people died five years ago in a blast blamed on several chemicals. In Beirut, the port and warehouse were at the heart of the city. And the amount of chemicals was enormous, 10 times more than France's AZF. The French plant, where investigators worked for years to determine the blast was accidental and not a deliberate attack.